Hey everybody, Spoonfed here, and um, I wanted to do a video for CO for Typo 3. I can just not get Typo 3 to be installed. I've tried a lot, uh, like all the things they said were should be wrong with it. It just does not want to work. And it's not that PHP doesn't get executed, that's what I thought at first, but it does get executed because I've done some test files. It just not, does not want to install. So um, I thought I'd do a weird CMS called Wolf CMS. Well, it's, it's not really weird, but um, it's something I've never heard of before until I installed the server. So I thought it would be cool. Um, to install and this one hopefully will install in one go yep save the file man save the file Let me just delete everything here because there's what was giving me problems My Windows is getting slammed. Ah, there we go. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Oh, I'll believe it. Right, now I have to cheat a bit because I have to, I want to upload it to the server and then, oh my god, this is annoying. There we go. Upload it to the server and then unzip it. That's faster for me. Uh, what you're gonna do is unzip it first and then upload it to your server. So make the connection via FileZilla. Did I just launch that or did it close on me again? Yeah, there we go. All right. I'm going to connect, yes, and I have to navigate my way through there, oh, let's go, alright, so I'm going to upload that, which doesn't take it that long, but I'll see you back there and I'll extract it on the server. Right, so there we go. It's been extracted. We can delete this file actually. All right, now it should go to this and then install if I'm not correct. If I'm correct, yeah, all right. So it doesn't matter because I've got my SQL Comfort files writable. It's not public write directory is writable. It's not clean URL support available. All right, so. Uh, I need to config file it does exist, but it's not writable, so I'll make that writable. Um, how can we do that? No, it's not writable. That's true. Just make it writable, like so. All right. I'll do another check. It's writable. All right. Public directory. Public at install root. All right. Public. Here we go. It's not writable. Uh, we'll do file permissions recursive down. And we'll just do it to directory. No, we'll not do directory. So we'll just do it like so. Let's see if it's correct now. Yes. All right. And clean uh, says not dig. Make sure you have refiled the name that into HD access. You only need clean URL support if you want to remove the question mark from the URLs. Mark. And here it says mod rewrite. The thing is, um, I actually have a different server. I don't have Apache, so I don't need an HD access file that does the mod rewrite. I have a rewrite rule inside my um, config of my server. So um, I am going to do this, but I quickly need to. Well, then I need to log out and change some settings. 
Uh, yeah, I'll just, that, that will work after that. First, let's just install this. So, install. So, it's MySQL. Yes, yes. Um, no. Well, not that one. Um, I did that. Database password is. Uh, you gotta be kidding me. I think I did this. Uh, database name is the same. It's that. There's no table prefix. Uh, yeah, I've created all of my own other. Cool, you can add a suffix to simulate statistic HTML files. That's pretty cool. And I then you can do this with clean URLs, but uh, admin install now. Access denied for that on um, that to database that. Let me just quickly um, set everything up so it will be correct. So I can do any needs to go like that. Alright. Let me just uh, find the um, database users and passwords and names for that because that's what we need. So, well, all right, made small mistake. Um, it is yes, it is so. But this one, uh, it's actually just showcase like that. All right, install now. Installation result config file database connection. Tables loaded. We can log in with this, and we need to copy that password. Um, we can do the security check now. Um, yeah, yeah, but uh, we can log in. Um, let me just like do that. Cool. That's awesome. All right, sorry. Run security check. Remove all write per permissions from the config file. So what we'll do is do file permissions. We'll remove that. All right. So we got done that. Again install directory is present and security is present so remove that and remove that all right now let's do that then so we'll uh, do delete yes so I have to wait a bit and security uh, no not download delete so all right then and should be that this one says no input file specified Exactly, and here we go. So admin that one login, and here we go. Administration uh, password. Where is it? Settings set. Oh, it's the users probably. Sorry, users uh, username password. There we go. All right, save. User has been saved. Cool. All right, so here we got some pages, uh, and let me show you what the site looks like now. That's what the site looks like now. <laughs> and yeah, it doesn't look like much, does it? Uh, layout. See, it's none. Wolf simple R six mil. Alright, this is very annoying. Somebody is messing with the server I'm on. Yeah, alright, uh, one moment. Alright, should be that it works now. Yeah, here we go. Cool. Reorder. Like so, disable reorder. What does it look like now? Oh, it looks still the same. Damn. What can we do? Let's 
that does this. Actually, it looks pretty cool. But why does mine look so nasty? Oh, cool. There's some new files that you can do. These are actually the pages. And, oh my god. Somebody is messing with my server. But that's it. That's what it looks like. I'm not quite sure why I cannot get the uh, look to work. So it might be admin layout. Oh, themes. Here you go. Here you got themes. Yeah, you should be able to uh, do something with themes. Administration, th oh, that's the administration team. Oh, righty then. Got you. Did not know that. So we, wait, one moment. Uh, layout, wolf, yeah. Do you have, like, mm, yeah, there's a style sheet there. Oh. Screen and print. Uh, one one. Where is it located then? Um, it's in the themes you write, and then wolf slash. Alrighty then. It's in wolf slash and then whatever, so it should be in here. Because here's the, here are the themes, but those are for admin only. Style sheet's not, just not present. That's the problem. Downloads, get in here. Wolf CMS. Public themes, wolf. That's it. I deleted the whole public file. It sh just shouldn't be writable anymore. E that's the problem. Alright, alright, alright. So because it says here echo themes URI slash wolf slash neat. So that's public, but I can make this uh, let me let me extract this. Uh, let me just fix that. Go here, go to public and um no, I don't need to do it like so, I need to do it like so. What I'm going to do here, I'm going to make a create directory uh, themes slash so theme slash we're going here, we're going here, and going there. So, oh crap, that was not what I wanted to do. Upload. All right. It should be okay to make this th um, themes slash themes slash and themes slash. Not really sure if it's anywhere else, but uh, who cares? Uh, let's save this. Uh, save. And that's how, what it should look like. Yeah. All right. Sorry that I, uh, I fucked up. So this is my second article, and you can go here. There are some tabs. This is really sim simplistic. Um, 
few, but this is the CMS um, uh, called Wolf CMS. So, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it and uh, good luck with it.